there's a need for a new world order. There's a need for a new world order. That we should have a world government, but only when the Messiah arrives. There's a need for a new world order. He wrote, illiterate, any attempt to achieve world order before that time must be the work of the devil. Well, join me. I'm, I'm glad to sit here at the right hand of Satan. There's a need for a new world order. At the right hand of Satan. In the councils of government, we must guard against the acquisition of unwarranted influence, whether sought or unsought, by the military-industrial complex. The United States is in a key position to shape this so that the problem of the Bush presidency will be the emergence of a new international order. 9-11 made their case for a new world order. There is a global meltdown coming. It is a global depression. And one world currency and one world financial system is the end game. China said last week they want one global currency. France said yesterday or the day before that they want one world order, a new world order, at the end of this event. The, the way we're going to win over the long term is not just militarily. We've got to win over uh, hearts and minds and what that means is we've got to invest in countries that uh, have no educational infrastructure and have no uh, means for young people to to get ahead we've got to give them a stake in creating the kind of uh, uh, world order that i think all of us would like to see in this new world such dangerous currents have swept along faster than our efforts to contain them and that is why we cannot afford to be divided but the burdens of global citizenship continue to bind us together. The walls between the countries with the most and those with the least cannot stand. The walls between races and tribes, natives and immigrants, Christians and Muslims and Jews cannot stand. These now are the walls we must tear down. We cannot continue to rely only on our military in order to achieve the national security objectives that we've set. We've got to have a civilian national security force that's just as powerful, just as strong, just as well funded. We've got to have a civilian national security force that's just as powerful, just as strong, just as well funded. To all the young people who are here, I want you to, to know what I'm going to be asking for. I'm going to be asking for all of you to serve this country. Serve in the military. Serve in the Peace Corps. Serve in the homeless shelter. Serve in some capacity for your community. We had a worldview. Republican and Democratic presidents alike, from Harry Truman to George Bush. And after 1989, President Bush kept said, and it's a phrase that I often use myself, that we needed a new world order. A new world order can emerge. Prime Ministers, German Chancellors, the Hollywood elite, the heads of business and academia, Federal Reserve Chairman, were traveling to the Grove each year. It's also important to note that the Grove itself was founded in 1872 by West Coast journalists, and that the National Press Club adopted the iconography of the Grove for its great seal. There are three major icons used in the cremation of care ritual. Moloch, the owl idol, the curved staff carried by the high priest and the eternal flame lamp, which the priest uses to ignite his torch to burn the human effigy care. At the right hand of Satan. At the right hand of Satan. There's a need for a new world order. We are the boys of the new generation. We are the voice of a new people.
destructive ways of the past are gone. We will replace them with our vision of the future. The party will lead us to the new age. There have been those who have tried to stop the new age. They are the corrupt reminder of the past. They have tried to confuse us with the idea that the old America was a good country. We know that lie. History teaches us that lie. We are grateful to our Soviet brothers who saved the world from destruction and we can now join them in a world of socialist brotherhood. Everyone will go to school, everyone will have a job, everyone will be equal. No one will exploit or be exploited and all those who oppose this wonderful vision will be crushed.